What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Welcome, welcome. Let me make sure this thing's loading. Good. We're good. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you're doing well. Welcome to some Deadliest Catch. Today we're going to be uh, playing some more on the... I think the Northwestern is the boat I'm on. I may be wrong about that. Uh, I may be on one of the other ones. Uh, actually, am on one of the other ones. Uh, we need to get out of here and uh, start a new game then. Uh, return to the main menu. Yes. I want to get the Northwestern boat. New game. Career. Uh, vessel type. The White Star, of course, the Northwestern. Uh, what is all this? Text color? Oh, that's right, we can name everything. Vessel's name? Uh, outhouse. Uh, I actually like the color and stuff. It looks good. Get a little orange outline on it. Looks good. Okay. Contour. Thickness. Ooh. Too much. Let's go like that, and then shadow, strength, softness. No, it's just straight up shadow. Oh, that looks really good. I like that actually. All right, uh, save changes. There we go. There we go. How's everybody doing in chat? Uh, Connor asked, "Will the game ever come to console?" Uh, Michael Pace answered and said, "Yes, it's coming to console, but it'll be delayed again." I have no idea on the actual date. I really don't know. Uh, I haven't seen an actual date for it. Let me show this message real quick. There we go. Um, yeah, I have no clue uh, what the actual date is for this coming to console. So, wish I could be more helpful on that. I will look it up and find out and post it down below, down below in the video if I find any information on it uh, after the stream. Bob, how are you? I hope you're doing well. Monster, what's up? Junior, how are you? Schlafer, how's it going, buddy? Spiderette, good to see you. Jeremy, what's up? Dan, how's it going? Junior said, welcome to the outhouse, everybody. Please hit the like button if you like what you see. Also, uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new. Bell to get notifications uh, to get more content from the crappiest place on YouTube. Absolutely, Junior. Thank you, man, so much for the uh, reminder there for everybody. Uh, today is 9-4-2000. You're starting your season with number one. Uh, starting your season number one of King Crab Fishing on the Bay of Sea will take 11 days. Okay, your current position well, the overall leaderboard is one. Good luck. Start season. Okay. So if I remember right, uh, we've got 50 grand. We can go to skills and get, uh, or maybe it's not skills. Maybe it's um, the shop. The shop. No. Some we buy perks. Where do we buy perks? Upgrades. Bar. Processing plant. Upgrades. Let's try this. There we go. Uh, available. So we need something to make stuff cheaper, right? Is that in skills? It might be in skills. Let's go over here. Crew management. That's the one I want. Uh, hire one crewmate. Accept. Okay. That cost us 10 grand. This one cost us, what, 20? Be able to hire two people? That might actually be worth it, but we need to get some other stuff done first. Uh, permanent 10% discount on Dutch Harbor Shop Goods. We're going to buy that. And then we're going to buy this one. To make everything a permanent 15% discount, and then we're going to buy that one for a thousand to make it a permanent 20% uh, discount on everything. So that's just kind of how I like to start mine. It's uh, it helps out a lot when you start buying gear. So, uh, what's up, Dan? Uh, Brandon, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. All right, tow under control. Uh, I don't feel like we're going to need a tow anytime soon. Friends in high places, fine reduction, don't need that. Uh, quick hands, you pull the grappling hook towards you towards your vessel faster. Um, for five grand, I think I'll wait on that one. That one's also five grand. What is this? Bait close to hand. You've always got bait on you. That is pretty expensive as well. That one is as well. Lower fuel usage. That would be nice. Skilled eye. Be able to check crab without uh, lifting them. That one would be fantastic, but it's a hundred grand. I don't have that kind of money at the moment. Uh, permission to sell crabs 24 hours after the season ends. That one is going to be handy to have. We'll buy that one later. Uh, favor of the guards. Raising. I don't think we're going to make it through an entire 11 days. Um, honestly, uh, raising limits allowed, uh, of incorrectly caught by 15%. That would be handy, but it's also 10 grand. So, uh, crewmates are performing their task 25% faster. I'm going to go ahead and buy that. Uh, 50% faster would be good, but it's 15 grand. We've only got 30 left. So, uh, crewmates are sorting crabs 15% faster. We're going to go ahead and buy that one. 
And then we're going to hold off on everything else. We're going to go over here to the store or the shop. And we're going to buy... How many crate, uh, crab pots do we have right now? One? We've only got one crab pot. Let's buy... Uh... Uh, let's go ahead and buy all eight. They're only 5,600, right? Yeah. Uh, and then we're going to buy some herring bait. Go ahead and stock up on them. All of them. There we go. And then we need uh, more buoys. We're going to go ahead and grab enough to cover all of our, all of our pots, plus a few extra. Uh, let me buy an extra grappling hook or two because they do break. We're going to need some penetrating oil. Uh, just buy 20 of those. It's way too many. I don't want to buy way too much of this stuff, but that's okay. Uh, these actually go through, you go through this pretty quick, so I'm going to buy those. And I'm going to buy uh, one more tote just in case. And I think that pretty much concludes uh, what we need to spend there. Let's go over here to the bar and make sure we've got enough money to hire one person at the very least. Is this game full release or still in access? I'm pretty sure it's full release. Uh, there's still updates for it, of course, but pretty sure it's full release. Uh, I think the first person I'm going to get is uh, Harry Sorter. There we go. And I think I can only hold one person, right? Wrong way. Skills. Yeah, we can only do one. It costs 20 to buy another person, but I can't do that yet. So the rest of this we're going to spend on upgrades for the ship, if I can. I don't know that I'm going to be able to. Um, resistant hydraulic system. Hydraulic system wears out much slower. That'd be nice. Smart Kohler when rope... Um, Cold turns on automatically when the line is attached to the coaling block. That'd be good. Uh, let's see. There's something about bait lasting longer. I'm going to go ahead and buy the efficient bait grinding. And 10% uh, more bait inside your fridge. Keep them fresher. Too expensive. It's 10 grand. Dang it. I missed it. That's the one I really wanted. I'll just go ahead and pick that one up then. Go back to available. Everything else is too expensive. So I think that pretty much concludes it. We'll spend the other uh, 4200 I've got on fuel. There we go. Now we're completely broke. I hope we catch something. Uh, off we go. Uh, let's check out the hot spots here. Doesn't like there's really any good ones, so we're going to sell over here, and we're going to go northwest when we get there. Alright. Let's go up to the wheelhouse. Gotta love this, uh... This front, this front climb here, this, this front wheelhouse. This is fantastic. I love it. Alright, we're going to go, yeah, just, just like we're going here, we're going to go straight, uh... Straight northeast. Directly northeast. All right, how do I get out of the seat now? Q, there we go. Q. All right, so I need to set... Uh, nope, tab. There we go. I need to set my crew task. Crew. Uh, this guy is going to be doing placing pot on the launcher. He's going to be doing uh, placing the pot on the launcher and launching the pot. And then uh, that's going to be it for now. I'm going to be doing the bait prep. I probably need to go ahead and do... Yeah. We can get one of these out. There we go. Bait going in. Let's go ahead and put all this away. We get 100% more out of each block of bait we put in. So, I think it used to, it used to be five. I, we'll see how many it is this time. Uh, ten. Okay. All right, cool. We got a, got a pot up. Open the pot. And crouch somehow. There we go. Put that there. I need to change my crouch button. That would be handy. Uh, buoy. Yes. Over it goes. Sweet. Off she goes. I love the Northwest. I love the way this thing looks. There it goes. Hope we're still on the same heading. We are. Okay, good. Buoy. Place the buoy, flip that, grab some bait. So a lot of this is going to be uh, how smooth does this game actually run now. That's going to be the thing. Oh, that was weird. Okay. 
Maybe I'm putting these two close together. Let's give it a minute here. That's pretty close. It's pretty close. It's pretty dang close. It's loud too, isn't it? Man. That's super loud. Well, good thing it's limited on your guys' end, because if not, it'd be it'd be bad. All right, how do we lower this? Uh, e to raise, R to lower. Let's lower it down a little bit there. I can crouch to put the bait in. I say that, finding the crouch button is a lot harder than it seems. All right, I'm going to give it a second. We're going to drop this one later. We'll drop this one after I can't see the first one anymore. Which is getting pretty close here. Cacper, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Joe, what's up, man? This game's what drew me to your channel? Yeah, I figured I'd throw it back in rotation. I was looking through my Steam list yesterday, and I was like, what can I put on for tomorrow uh, that has to do with, with vehicle-style games, right? So, uh, Farm Manager 2021, not necessarily, but you can buy tractors. So that's kind of what I was going for with that. That was kind of the idea, anyway. All right, the first one is out of sight, so let's go ahead and throw our buoys up. Let's close the pot. Throw our buoys up. There we go. We'll wait on him to get another one. But yeah, I figured I figured doing this today would be fun. I figured it'd be fun. Something something a little different. Something a little bit different. I'm gonna go ahead and bait this thing, I think. Yeah, the last time I played this was like August, I think. So it's it's been a while, man. Um, it's actually been entirely too long. To be fair. All right, how are we looking here? How are we looking? Let's let it get a little bit further out of sight before we drop again. Yeah, I like the fishing, man. It's fun. It's a lot of fun, actually. I'm pretty happy I'm back to it as well. Although today may not be a super long stream. Uh, I didn't get any errands run this morning, so I've got to do it this afternoon. Um, so, uh, probably... Hour 45 or so. Maybe two hours today. But either way... Uh, doing some fishing. Oh, that pot's completely out of sight now. Let's go ahead and drop. And I just hope we, I hope we, I hope we're in a good spot here because I really don't know. There goes the crane. Get our bait block out here, or our bait out here. And then when that one gets out of sight, we will uh, we'll drop it again. So we're still on this northeast heading, directly northeast. So, what's up, Gabriel? How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Any new updates for this? I think bug fixes and such. Uh, I think they, when it came full release, was pretty much all of the uh, major updates, as far as I know. So there's only still only two boats to choose from. You need to have talk with your crane man. He drops that pop pretty hot. He does, but that's really the only option the game gives you. So not really a whole lot I can say to him. He's he's doing all he can do over here. go get that in hit that button and then we're gonna stand here and wait we'll watch them watch them icons float away from us cut his pay yeah, instead of making three percent he's gonna make one percent <laughs> yeah he is uh oh man waves are waves are getting up a little bit I mean, look out across there. Daytime is really, really nice, especially like the morning, the morning, uh, morning and sunset. 
Sunrise and Sunset is really nice in this game. Look at all that water out there. There's not a whole lot of, like, ocean motion, though. Which is okay, I guess. Did I put bait in that? I hope I did. If not, then I'm going to be picking up an empty pot. Bait. There comes the pot. There we go. Yeah, I put bait in that other one. The only reason I dropped that down is just a little easier to get to. Have I seen or heard about the YouTube exploit video? Uh, probably not. I have no idea. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what that is. I guess. I mean, maybe. I don't know what it is. So. It's possible. <laughs> I really don't know. All right, that one's just about to disappear for us, so go ahead and drop that one in. And then we got one more pot to drop, and then we'll skip some time and catch some crab, hopefully. There he is. All right, we'll wait a minute on that. Yeah, I've been, that's the reason I've been doing the polls, honestly. I just want to see what happens. Maybe I need to rewatch it. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Either that or they fixed it and just didn't say anything to anybody, which is very possible. YouTube does that on a regular basis. They change things and don't really tell anybody, but they tell people, you know? But yeah, Gabriel, I think it's the same one. I think it's the same one you posted. Yeah, maybe I need to rewatch it. Maybe I missed the keyword options or, or whatever it was. So, Philip, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. But yeah, maybe maybe that's the problem. Maybe I missed some things. All right, all pots have been launched. We are going to uh, go back up to the wheelhouse here and uh, spun around. Looks like we're in top gear already, so. So I think there are engine, uh, trans, uh, not in engine upgrading by now where you can have six speeds, six gears, instead of four. Yeah, I think I missed the keywords part. I was trying to, I was shooting for the community interaction thing, but I think I missed the keywords. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna try to break the break the algorithm and see what happens with it. Getting everybody started on polls is a good thing, though. Tater Salad, what's going on, buddy? I hope you've been doing well. Good to see you. Good to see you. It is awfully quiet in here. Compared to outside. You hear that rain, though. And believe it or not, this is largely a calm ocean. If it's the first time seeing this, you see in this game, this is largely uh, pretty calm. The, the waves do get much bigger. Even trying to make sure to uh, comment, like, and vote in the polls. I think that was part of it. Yeah, I'm just missing like keyword tags, I guess, in the in the poll itself, or in the question, or in the in the answers, maybe. But yeah, I definitely want to try to break the algorithm. I'm all for it. <laughs> I'm all for it. They really need to add all the boats? Yeah, man. I don't know. I don't know why they haven't added more. I'll be real honest. I really don't. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. I have no idea what's going on with that.
I guess we can go ahead and set our crew. What's the button for the crew? Hang on a minute. You guys aren't going to be able to see this very well, but... Uh... Okay. Right control. Okay, that's what it is. Right control. Right control. There we go. All right, now we're going to take this guy, and we're going to put him down here for catching and reeling the pot. I'm going to do that. Uh, place pot on launcher. He's going to do... Throw out crab. I'm gonna do, and then we'll wait to see on the first one if we're gonna store the store the pot or not. So, maybe they're holding back from massive updates. I mean, that's true. Yeah. Try to copy and paste the poll from uh, Spiffing Brit just to see if it increases the count. I could, yeah. I definitely could. I will try that today, actually. I think I, I think I know what I'm playing tomorrow, so I'll try that today. Yeah, they may be holding back for massive updates for this game. It's very possible. It happens sometimes, so... What's up, Brian? How's it going? Good to see you. What kind of features does this have? Uh, it's it's fairly in depth now. So as you can see, you got crew members. You can have up to four, and you can have them placed in different positions. Um, if we go back. You can see the vessel here. What all we have: buoys, warehouse items, pots. You can move stuff to your warehouse. Uh, vessel upgrades. We can go here and see what the upgrades we have and what's available. Uh, they're leaderboards, so basically you're just against the AI, I think. So, um, but yeah, there's that season one. Uh, I think we're in. I don't know why this keeps doing this. It keeps dropping all the way to the bottom. Several other things do this too. Maybe it's my. I think it's my side panel that does this. Yeah, it's got to be my side panel because I don't have anything else on. Uh, but either way, uh, yeah. So there are different seasons uh, for the save. You can go to the map and check your hot spots and whatnot. Uh, so, and if you hover here, you guys can't see it. Uh, oh, you can. You can. It's not covering it up. Okay, so down at the bottom right-hand corner, you'll see where it says Sandy. Uh, and if you go to this area here where the lines are, it's muddy. And there, there's there's some decent fish in here, but... Uh, and then you have depth. So, 36 fathoms here. This area up here seems to be 10. Uh, this is 10 fathoms. I try to stay about uh, 10 fathoms just because uh, I tend to catch better crab there. Uh, but I would like to go out here in one of these hot spots in the deep areas. Uh, that's 284 fathoms. That's, that's way too long and rocky at that. Um, so something like this would be good. Something in this area. Anything in here. A little deeper, depending on the time of the year and that and, and whatnot. It seems like we're the only boat up here. Other than, well, I don't know. We're not really. Everybody else is coming up too. Uh, but you learn more about it as you as you get your skills leveled up. You can purchase different things. You can get fined for different things. Abandoned crab pot, improving crab, lost crab, off season catching. Uh, and then you get your manual you can go through, and then you get your crew members. So there, there's, a, there's a good bit to it. Um, but it's pretty easy otherwise. It's really not a hard game. We're drifting hard to the right here. You bought Yorkshire tea because of the spiffing grip? <laughs> nice. Yeah, there's actually quite a bit going on. It's just kind of slow. You know what I mean? Like it's not a, it's not an action-packed game where every two seconds something's gonna be happening. Like some of this is, it's kind of slow. Which I am comfortably okay with today. I slept about four hours, so I am pretty tired. I've been chugging coffee all morning. I actually had a hot tea this morning, believe it or not. I don't drink hot tea, but I had hot tea this morning, uh, pour over. Uh, and it was our tea that we normally brew for sweet tea, so it was not great uh, because it was non, it wasn't like a, a good tea. It was just our, our regular tea that we use for sweetened tea. Spiffing attempts to break games on purpose, just breaks them on accident. That's true. 
That's true. I don't I don't intend to break games when I play them. I just do it for some reason. Four hours, that's your normal? Man, for me, four hours is tough these days. I think it's because I don't do anything else. Like, when I was doing concerts, man, four hours was a good night of sleep. Five hours was definitely a good night of sleep. And if I, if I got to sleep in on a Saturday, it was like going on vacation. <laughs> so, uh, but these days, man, after not doing anything for a year, I feel like I need to start exercising more. I've been talking about this for like eight months now. I need to get out and walk every day, and I still haven't started doing that. There are days where I go out and walk around the neighborhood, but I don't do it every single day. I probably should. But I'm not, I'm, it's not like I just sit in my chair for, for 14 hours. Like, I actually, about every hour, if I'm not streaming, I'll get up and move around the house, do stuff, and come back. So. Christy, how are you? Good to see you. Oh, there's some big waves. Zoom out a little bit. Yeah, see, there's still, like, the camera shaking. There's still a lot of little little things they could do. I like the drop-in, drop-out, though. Oh, the, the waves wasn't that big. Zoom back around to this side here. So we could actually stay outside the boat. Uh, I prefer it sometimes. But not all the time. Like getting the Tuz 420 to stand on its end. That was that was interesting. That was purely accidental, but it was interesting. I am fine. Thank you for asking. I appreciate you asking, Christy. You do something for my mental health? I do. I do. I've, I've been spending like I, I'm not stressing out about about making content anymore, man. It it is what it is at this point. Um, I, I can't make everybody happy, and that's okay. You know what I mean? Like I'm just I'm just doing me now, dude. I don't even care at this point. If people don't want to watch, they're not going to watch. I can't force people to watch, and if you know they're not happy with what I'm playing, that's okay too. So. Um, but at the same time, I've been spending a lot more time with uh, Miss Deuce in the afternoons and, and watching TV and whatnot, so uh, hanging out with the family and, and all, you know. And this camera is really awkward sometimes because when I move my mouse to the left, it actually points my screen to the right and then vice versa. This is move my mouse right, it goes to the left. It just feels kind of odd. Everything else is the opposite direction of that. All right, let's put her in reverse now. Back up to this buoy. Slow going. Slow going. Jeremy reminded everybody to hit that like button. Please do. It does help the stream out a bunch when you do. Your favorite part of the pandemic. Yeah, man, absolutely. I mean, the, the, we're homeschooling now, so I mean, the kids home every day. Uh, and there are days where if I don't stream, I'll go in there and we'll watch some TV or something, you know, during the day, so. Alright, I think if we hold up here and then we press T, we can choose how much time to skip, so. I think I'm gonna do, uh, what was it, like 16 hours was the best? I think that's right. We'll see what, we'll see what kind of weather we get here. Raining and daytime. That's okay, though. Alright, let me grab the rope. Get the hook out. Oh, we need a hook. Uh, where's the, let me get the hook out here. There we go. Get it hooked up to the line. Uh, e to use grappling hook. Okay. A to pull in the rope. That's way different than it used to be. Way different than it used to be. All right, this guy's supposed to be setting the pot. I think. I get the hook drop. Uh. Side. I got it. I got it. Don't worry. Don't worry, bud. Uh, this is not a bad, that's not a bad amount of crab. Actually, that's not great. We're probably going to move on. We're probably going to move on. Wait, what is this guy doing? Hang on. Hang on. What's, what's going on here? Uh, putting pot on a launcher. Placing pot on launcher. Okay. He's not supposed to be dumping the crab, though. Throwing the crab out. It's not a bad amount of crab. Normally it's about 80, so we'll we'll run with this. I'll just dump back here. That's okay. Yeah, we'll just dump back there. That's okay. That's fine. Alright, while we're trucking to the next one, we'll put him sorting crabs as well. So 
Uh, storing pot. Crab sorting. There we go. And we'll head on to the next one. Bot not working. No, man. Bot's not working on YouTube for some reason. I don't know why. Where was I headed? I was headed to this uh, this other end here. As long as you're putting out content that makes me happy, we're all good. That's the goal. That's the goal. <laughs> I mean, that's another reason I don't mind doing the um, the polls on YouTube uh, for the for what I'm streaming because I can I can still get a general consensus of what the majority of people want to watch, as well as uh, I, I can I only put stuff on the poll that I want to play that day. So, you know what I mean? Like it's a good mixture of both, and it keeps me kind of guessing too. So, uh, now does it hinder my scheduling? a little bit because I could schedule the stream earlier the day before so everybody knows it's coming tomorrow but that's okay it's okay but yeah I just feel like there's no there's no way to win so I figure if I can't win I'll just do what I can we may actually completely stop before we get to this thing we're going to actually ease on up a bit here I don't know if I can hit that thing from here or not. Gotta move up more. There we go. Uh, no, back. I don't wanna do that. There we go. Oh my goodness. Stumbling around. Let's let the hook down there. We'll see if this takes precedent for this guy. It looks like it's going to. 13 good crab out of this. It's not great strings, but it's close. You pick the last option every time? I mean, you know, just keep it random, right? Keep it random. You like this game, Christy? Yeah, it's it's slow. It's a slow game. Uh, I played it quite a bit over the over the last year and a half or so, but uh, I think a lot of people can't get on board because it's it's there's really a lot of downtime here. So um, there's not it's no action. You know, there's not a whole lot going on. You're just kind of just kind of here. You know, doing the work. Putting in the work. It's kind of like Gold Rush, but there's less action than Gold Rush, even. <laughs> Gold Rush has more action than this. At least you're getting to watch an excavator, you know? But I still don't mind. I like the laid-back aspect of it, and I like the goals that you have to try to get to. There's a lot you have to try to do in this game in a short season, so... The season ends in nine days, remember? So... Uh, there's a lot you have to do, but I've never flipped to a new season, so I don't really know how that's going to feel, and I'm hoping today we can get through an entire season and see what happens. Homeschooling was fun. We watched Monk as part of some lessons from criminal justice. We we watched the crap out of Monk. That was That's probably one of my favorite shows ever. Ever. And I had never watched it, but my cousin used to love watching it when it was actually coming on TV. Um... Or when it started or whatever, he was watching, he always talked about it, and I never knew what he was talking about, but that is my favorite show ever, probably. And now we're watching The Mentalist, which is... <laughs> it's like a cross between White Collar and Monk. It's really odd, because Jane's a really odd character, but he's so super smart, and he's really slick, too. So he's like a combination of the guy from White Collar and Monk. Uh, and maybe a little bit of Psych in there as well, because of his... Uh, uh, not necessarily his psychic abilities, but you get it, yeah. Yeah, Mentalist is such a good show. It is such a fantastic show. It, it's really surprising, honestly, how good it is. Like, I, I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I do. All right, we'll get out here a little further and get lined back up on this northeast heading. Go forward a little bit more here. This one's not right up against the boat this time, thank goodness. All right, there we go. Should be just in range. Maybe. There we 
go pull the line in. I like that animation better. So before there was kind of a weird animation with the rope you had to like... Oh, it's doing that thing again. There we go. Uh, there's still a few bugs in this that, that I feel like should have been fixed by now. Um, I think he raises that. We're gonna, we're gonna let him go there. Oh, my bad. Let me get the buoys. Let me get the buoys. Yeah, he's gonna raise the hook up. Okay. You watched it right after finishing Monk? Yeah, I think we watched Monk and then we watched something else. Uh, and then we, then we started the Mentalist. Or they did. They started it without me, so I don't even know the beginning. I didn't even see the first couple episodes. I think they started it one day while I was streaming. That Saturday I streamed on Twitch all day. I think they started it then. Or maybe it was before. No, it was before then. I don't know exactly when they started it, but... Uh, yeah, they started it without me anyway, so... I'm gonna try a different bait this time. So, on pots, uh... How many pots have we done? Two or three? Three? Hang on. Uh... I don't know how many I actually have down. Does it tell me? Is that two pots? I think it's two pots back there. Anyway, yeah, on pot three on we'll have, uh... We'll have sardine in there. I think that's sardine, right? Yeah, sardine bait. Get our bait put over. Oop. Too quick. Alright, we got nine left. But yeah, the mentalist is so good. So good. <clears throat> I was I was really surprised that like those kind of shows, typically I don't really watch them, but Psych, Monk, and then The Mentalist, White Collar. Like, I can sit down and watch those. I could probably watch Monk again. I could watch White Collar for a third time. I've watched the entire se uh, series twice. Uh, once when it came out, and then once with Miss Deuce and the kid. But I could watch White Collar probably an entire another go-through for a third, third series watch-through. You're still waiting for a good dirt digger simulator like Gold Rush to make it into the pole? Oh man, that would be tough. I would literally hope to load up my old save where I already have stuff. It's possible it could make it in one day. Uh, we'll do a, uh, a Discovery Channel simulator pole one day. She can't stand it? Oh, I love Psych. I think it's such a good show. If you get past the first couple of, if you get past the first like seven episodes of it, you realize that it's supposed to be quirky and corny and and kind of cheeky, you know, like like for at first I didn't like it really. I'd seen a couple episodes of it when we started watching it, but I'd never really watched it. Watched it, so we watched it from the beginning, and uh, you know, two episodes in, I'm going, eh, you know, it's okay. And then by like season three, we're all psychos in the house, so which is what the psych fans are called or whatever so I mean, we're all like hardcore fans of psych we watched the, the the movie uh we watched the second movie waiting on the well i think there was the second one right waiting on another one to come out like i mean we, we we've watched everything psych related we can find we even watched the uh um the interviews after the series ended we watched all of it like we, we were, we're all diehard psych fans here but it took me a while. It took me to like five, six episodes in to really be a fan of the show. I don't know why. I just it's like, man, I, I don't know. I forgot how long this boat is. And you don't realize how far you can actually see those buoys out of the window either. There we go. I'll lower the hook. Don't worry about it. How you doing on sorting over here, bud? Oh, look at him go. Heck yeah. Making his making his way through him. There you go. I'll take this. Watch him work. Have I watched Chuck? I have. I don't think we've watched Chuck. No, I don't think anybody in the house has watched it actually. So there used to be an automatic crab thing, right? That you used to be able to get for this, but I don't think they left it in the game. I think they took it out. 
Uh, there was like 160 on there. How much is in here now? Maybe there's 120 on there. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad. Let's get these in here. There we go. We'll get this. Flip back over. Perfect. Now, off we go again. You get back to sorting. I'll get back to driving. Yeah, I haven't seen Chuck. Is it pretty good, too? Uh, Gold Hunter? Yeah. Yep, Gold Hunter MP. I've been following it for a very, very, very long time. Uh, it's been... It's been in development for at least two years now. Uh, I've been following it for quite a while. So originally it was going to be kind of, I mean, it's kind of like Gold Rush, right? But they were going to do multiplayer stuff, and now it's Gold Hunter MP is what it's called. So I hope they do it where you can play together on one claim, but it, it's looking more like you're going to be facing each other. So you're going to have your own claim and somebody else is going to have it. I really hope that's not the case, though. I hope it's, I hope it's one of those situations where... You know, you can all play together on one claim because that would be amazing if if you could. So, ACDC, what's going on? Finally caught alive. Welcome, welcome. Siri's over here trying to be nosy on the conversation. So, yeah, looking out of the window right here, this pot looked like it was right next to me. It was really toward the back of the boat, so I don't know. Uh, oh, I accidentally put it in reverse. Yeah, it looks really interesting. Watching the live streams are good, but um, sometimes they do live streams that are not in English, so I don't really understand what's going on. Um, which, even if it was in English, doesn't guarantee that I'm going to know what's going on. So <laughs> it doesn't doesn't really guarantee anything for me. Uh, but uh, there, there's a lot of stuff in that game. I think they're I think they're doing the right thing by taking their time, not releasing it to early access, all that kind of stuff. I think I actually backed it on Kickstarter. I, I honestly can't remember, to be fair. Alright, what you do with the buoys? Oh god, the buoys are under the table. This is not good. Uh, there we go. You just busted the buoys, man. I'm glad I brought extras. Actually, I need to close that, too, before somebody steps in it. That would be awkward. The second movie is called Lassie Comes Home. Oh, that's right. Yeah, 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 that's right. Is it out? If it's out, I don't think we've seen it. Isn't that after he had the stroke? I'm pretty sure the actor actually had a stroke, like the actual actor. Uh, but they they wrote it back into the they wrote back into the the show, the movie somehow. What you know his his disability or whatever it was, so. something of that nature. It's on Peacock. That's right. We've talked about this before. You guys told me it was out. Yeah, I need to I need to get Peacock. So we can watch it. Hello from North Carolina. Thank you for the streams. They've helped me through so many insomniac nights and late nights with my infant daughter. You are very welcome, ACDC. You are very welcome. I am happy to be here uh, to provide some sort of relief for everybody. Um, I always tell people as long as as long as it makes a difference in one person's day, that's 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 a goal. So that's what matters. I'm glad you've been enjoying them, and uh, I'm glad to have been a part of. Uh, making it through some of the rough, rough times and rough nights. Oh, Peacock's free for Xfinity? Really? Ah, okay. Okay. He gets shot in the movie. That's how they wrote him into it. Ah, okay, cool. I'm glad they did, though, man. I'm glad they did. He's got such a good character. Like, he really does. Got it in. Drop the hook. This is going pretty well. Uh, with just one crew member. It's doing okay. Let me get out of his way here. Uh, I am going to have to spend some time throwing crab, though. Uh, off the table.
I'd like to see me go back and do more Barrett Sea fishing. Barrett Sea or Northern Sea? The new one. What's up, Dylan? How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, fishing northern seas is their newest one. Or North Atlantic. Fishing North Atlantic, I think. It's their newest one. Get to move on again. Barency. Barency was pretty good. It was pretty good. They made a lot of improvements, a lot of changes in, in northern sea, though. Not, not drastic, but a lot of small things. When you get your Alaskan King Crab for your birthday, that's awesome. Yeah, I used to watch Deadly Sketch all the time. I actually started watching, um, what's the one where, uh, Josh from the Cornelia Marie, he goes chasing, uh, Phil's, Phil's dream down in Hawaii fishing. Uh, swordfish? Is that right? Or marlin? Whatever it is they're fishing for down there. I started watching that. I got about three episodes into it. So I got to go back and catch up though. Are they still doing Deadliest Catch? The the show? Is it still on? Like, is it still? Uh... I guess are they making new episodes for it? What I'm asking. I like how it actually shows you the hook now. That's kind of neat. Before it didn't really show you where the hook landed on the rope. It just kind of drug them in. Man, it's a nice calm day on the Barent Sea today. The Bering Sea. Sorry, not the Barent Sea. We're talking about the Barent Sea. A real ice road truckers game? Yeah, Alaskan, Alaskan truck simulator. Uh, it's going to be close, but it's not going to be Ice Road Truckers. But it's going to be kind of neat, man. I'm, I'm really looking forward to that game. It's a survival trucking game. Like, it, it combines survival game with, with trucking. I think it's actually going to be pretty, pretty, pretty decent. The way it looks, anyway. Alright, back up top we go. One more pot to pick up, and then we're going to turn around and do it all over again. See how much money we can make. What do you get through this season? That's going to... It's... We're actually going to eat up a lot of time. Like, this doesn't, but the skipping nights and stuff, do or skipping time does to get the uh, pots ready, it, it eats up a lot of time, so. You don't think it's still home? You haven't had a Discovery in a long time? Yeah. Uh, I haven't either. We haven't had cable in quite some time, so... Um, like, we, we, we opted to cut the cable and just keep the internet, and it, it's... Well, I haven't really missed much, but I've missed a few shows, I guess, so... Oh, forgot you gotta do this now. Used to, you didn't have to do that. You could just walk and throw it, so... Now you actually have to uh, click use or throw the hook or whatever to attach yourself to the side rail. Which is kind of odd. I don't really understand that. I think you'd just be able to use the use the hook wherever, right? You would think so anyway. You have Discovery Plus. I mean, that might be worth getting, honestly. There's a lot of good stuff there. Alright, so so far we've got 100 good crab and 121 bad crab. I'm hoping... Uh, switching bait will keep them here or maybe uh, even catch us a few more so I don't know for sure though uh, so since the update I've only played once since the update where the bait matters uh, consistency matters on what you're doing uh, I don't know if they ever actually put in anything where you could fish for your own bait is that a thing it might actually be a thing all right back up we go 
And that was the last pot, so we're gonna spin around and do it all over again. We're gonna let him sort, though, while we're uh, jogging back down to the other end. Yeah, 15 seasons so far. I think I think the last one I saw was season 14, so I haven't seen anything from season 15, I don't think. Yeah, it's been a long time since I played uh, Baron C, I guess. I didn't realize how long it had actually been. But it's been a while. Oh, sun glare. It's always nice. Uh, while we're jogging back down to the other end, though, I'm going to give you guys the outdoor view here. I'm going to go hit the outhouse and uh, I want you guys keep an eye on the buoys and stuff for me over behind me. I don't want to put you directly in the sun, though. It's pretty bright. Uh, I'll let you guys keep a look on everything, and I'll be back momentarily. I can't believe this guy just left the, left the screen up for three minutes of him just going one direction in the boat. Uh, the good news is we got two, two, three buoys. How many, how many we got left to go? Oh, we still got a long way to go. Holy crap, man. Not moving fast at all here. Uh, but I'm back. <laughs> Thought I was moving a lot faster than that. Apparently, apparently I'm not. Yeah, a real ice road truckers game would be kind of interesting. I think it'd be kind of neat. Now I'm hungry for fried soft shell crab sandwich. <laughs> it's 
Stoner, how's it going? How's it been going, man? Been a while. Been a while. And Salvage, how are you? I hope you're doing well today. Uh, Blendero? I'm your fan. Say my name, please. I, I, I tried. I tried. That's probably wrong. But I tried. <laughs> Klaus, <laughs> Klaus says, from this view, look at that boat's been in a, been in a fire. Yes, yeah, the sun. The way the sun's hitting it. Or the shadow on it. It's not really great shadow effects, to be quite fair. Uh, it's pretty, pretty terrible shadow effects, actually. Pretty terrible. You've been okay? Well, it's okay's good. It's better than bad. Right? Maybe. There's a place on uh, uh, Long Beach Island, New Jersey, makes killer soft shell crab. I've never had one. I've never had a. I've never had soft shell crab. I don't think. To be fair. You live near Moorhead City and had shrimp and oyster po' boy last weekend. Seafood's the best. Now I want to make crab cakes. Man, see, I live in like middle Mississippi, so. We can get some fresh stuff here, but it's not really fresh. We go down to the beach, you know. It's just, it's a long drive. It's a long drive. Just been going through a tough time and I'm getting there. Yeah, Dom, I think, I think we all know the feeling on some level. Um, I think everybody has been uh, hit with some tough times. Some worse than others, of course. Some, uh, maybe not for the same reasons, but uh, don't feel like you're alone in that. I think everybody has been suffering lately. There's just nowhere to get get uh, soft shell crab here, man. Not fresh soft shell soft shell crab, anyway. I would love to. There's just nowhere to get like good uh, soft shell. Now, during uh, during certain seasons, I can get uh, fresh shrimp here, but that's it. Uh, I think the Bubba Gump Shrimp uh, Company uh, is the one that. They, they take it over to Alabama and then people bring it over from there. So. <laughs> you gotta play this again? It's been a while, man. It's been a while since I played it. Um, although the last time we did play it was the full full release of the game, so I think all the all the big updates are in, sadly, because there's only two boats still. Uh, I know at one time I was reading something about this. They wanted to do uh, a lot more boats. They wanted to give you options. Have to come over to the DC area, then you get the best soft shell crab. I mean, honestly, I don't, I don't ever plan on going to the DC area. To be fair, uh, I don't, I don't really want to. <laughs> I don't know if I want to, man. I don't like traffic. I like living in my little town down here. Throw her in neutral and just get turned here, maybe. In the caves under the sewers where the crab people live, so you can get fresh stuff all the time. All you need is body armor and a sharp sword. I mean, depending on depending on what you're doing, yeah, I guess that's true. How are you, Smudo? Hope you're doing well today. We get to skip a day. That means it's going to take us down to eight days and some change left. All right, time. Skip uh, 18 hours this time. See if that matters. Oh, there comes the rain again. I knew that was going to happen. 
I knew it was. Oh, he's done sorting crap. I need to get those off the table, I guess. I'm gonna grab my tote. Let's do some let's do some crab tossing. Uh throw crabs overboard. Oh. I actually have to look down now, that's weird. Okay. It's only a certain spot. Oh, they go out right there. Okay, I see. You used to be able to just toss them. Now you can't do that. You have to actually hit the little, uh, the slot for the crabs to go out. It's kind of funny. I, I didn't know, I didn't know that, I don't think. I don't think that was in the last one. Uh oh. You guys see the clouds coming in? It's gonna be pretty nasty for the weather. We need to, is there, is there a weather check? Can you do that? No, see, that's something that should be in the game. You should be able to check the weather. I want to know if we're about to get hit by a storm or if it's just some rain or what. It, it makes a difference. Also, the whole bouncing around thing, I don't get. Like, when you're moving, it feels like you're bouncing everywhere. It's almost that, that sway from Medieval's Dynasty is what it feels like. It feels a lot like that. We're putting crab in the tank. That's the main thing, right? Crab in the tank. All right, cool. All right, let's pick this first pot here and see if there's anything in it. If there's not, we'll stack. Hopefully there will be. I'm hoping there will be. Oh, yeah, okay. There's definitely something in there. We'll see how this goes. I don't know how much is in there. Oh yeah, I'm sure. DC DC is like at my history, the history side of me. That's not. I'm not a huge history buff, of course. I'm not an expert on anything, but the the part of me that that loves early America style history really wants to go. But the rest of me goes, nope, <laughs> nope, not doing it. It's more humane tossing them through the hole. I guess so. I guess so. Yeah. Oh, he's waiting on me. All right. So this works. Um, I'm going to put these last few sardine in the first two here. Oh, the waves. The waves are really getting big now. Uh, I'm going to put the, the last of my sardines in these first few, and then we will switch over to the other bait. Oh, yeah, the waves are definitely getting big. And Gabby, how are you? I hope you're well. Yeah, this is going to get real interesting. Uh, but we gotta we gotta do it. We gotta work through it. We've only got eight days left in the season, so I gotta work through the storms. We're actually going backwards right now, believe it or not. That wave that wave just rolled us backwards. Oh, them are some big ones. Them are definitely some big ones. Yeah, see, some of the sounds and stuff still don't, it's not, it doesn't seem right. Like, you don't hear the, the waves actually crashing against the boat. You just hear the rain. And that just gets annoying. All right, there's 49 on the table. We'll see how good we do here on the turnout. Cold? I'm doing well. I'm doing good. A uh, little bit of, a little bit of sleep last night. For most people, it's probably enough. For me these days, it's tiring, but uh, <laughs> been drinking coffee and tea all morning. So at 49 on the table, we got 129 in there. Somebody do the math for me. Is that 50 or 60? 60, 70, 70 crap. That's not bad. All right, what do we got left? Three, so we're gonna have four, uh, four pots. I've got eight. We're gonna have four pots with sardine, and then four with whatever the next one is. It's not a herring. It's uh, something else. Whatever the next one is there. And these waves. Oh my goodness. I think we're fishing in the trough here. Just look at that. Can't even see my buoys anymore. I'm way off too. 
Waves are really thrashing me around here. This is this is when we need to be outside right here. See just how big some of these waves are, man. Yeah, see, I I, I still don't like the graphics on the outside and the big waves though. But it's okay. It doesn't feel like you're hitting big waves, you know. Well, I say that. And the whole camera got flipped over. Sorry, I was trying to readjust to get a little lower. Yeah, we're pulling to the left hard here. We're getting pushed. Current's pushing us. Oh, man. Okay, so now I can feel the big waves. I ask. You ask and you shall receive. Let's get back in cab. I don't know why it's always spinning my camera around. Alright, we're good. We got this. Hope everybody's got the Dramamine on them. It's going to be a long night. Oh, hang on. Dang it, did it again. I ah, see, now I gotta go back forward. We're getting bounced around here. Oh man, I'm trying to throw a hook in these big waves. We got it, but. Man. Even waves rolling us. They were surfing. Oh boy. Sitting still is probably not the best idea. But it just doesn't have the. Like, I don't feel like we're in big waves. You know what I mean? I feel like it's just like. Oh, okay, the boat's rolling around a little bit. It doesn't have that terrifying feeling, you know? Like, I want to be terrified out here. <laughs> Keep those buckets close by, exactly, yeah. Gail, how are you? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well today. Oh, man. Waves are really thrashing us around here. What else can you put in this box? Like, why do I have to select a buoy? I don't, I don't understand that quite well either. I don't... I don't know why I actually have to select the buoy. Like, there's, there's just the, it's the buoy box. There should be nothing else in there. I should hit E and grab a buoy out of it. But, you know, I'm doing just fine, Gail. I appreciate you asking. Yeah, I was really surprised when the, uh, the pole came back deadly as catch. I was like, well, okay. And of course, I wouldn't have put it on there if I didn't want to play it. But either way, I didn't know how many people would actually want to watch it, so. You didn't vote in the poll? That's okay. I mean, it's not required. I just put it out there to get a feel for what everybody's looking to see. The majority was this, so. Yeah, I remember when, when this game first came out, the big waves weren't even a thing. So they've come a long way, but it just feels like it's, it still feels like it's kind of hollow. You know, it's like a hollow threat. There's nothing, it's not really, I don't feel like I'm endangered by the size of the waves, if that makes sense. I don't know if I got the buoys. I guessed at it, but I got them. 
Oh man, water washing over the deck now. Maybe time to go in. Nah, we're crabbers. We'll keep going. It's weird seeing me streaming on YouTube and not also streaming on Twitch. I haven't done that in since 2018, where I stream at the same time. I've been streaming on Twitch at night and YouTube during the day for two years. I mean, I swapped the schedule up a little bit, but yeah, it's been a long time since I've done both. All right, last sardine bait. That means we have four pots left. Oh, man, look at this water coming over the rail. Jeez. These waves are huge, man. Huge. Can I go up again? I want to go up again. I want to get up on top of this rig. Aha. Uh -huh. Lieutenant Dan. What are you doing up there? Is that all you got? Sorry. It just made made me made me think of uh Forrest and Lieutenant Dan there. Right, get back in the back in the captain's seat. Back in the captain's seat. That's a dangerous place to be in big waves, that's for sure. Yeah, that's for sure. Well, I mean, it beats being trapped in the boat if it flips over, though. Right? I would think. Although the lightning, maybe, is not such a good thing to be up there, but... Yep, we'll do, Gabriel. Hey, man, have a good one. Uh, appreciate you hanging out with us today, as always. And uh, good luck. Uh, I say that to you because in a year you're going to be saying that to me, so good luck. to see Moby Dick I'm telling you it's uh it's pretty rough out here at the moment this is uh this is pretty nuts right now Turn on the table 170 we got 58 good crap that's not bad uh salary mate how do you say this is it salary sorry Salary. I was going to say salary because that sounds right to me. Get all this bait out of here. Blech. There we go. 10 salary bait. All right. We are baited and buoyed. Flip her over. 246 with 58 good ones on the table. Not too bad. Not too shabby today so far if we do I have to start calling Deuce Ishmael I'm telling you I'm, I'm I tell you what uh, playing straight in deep yesterday and seeing that big uh, whale's tail come up out of the water actually scared me a little bit I was like holy crap man I think it's huge. Ooh. I feel like that one almost got us. Boat actually listed pretty hard to the uh, starboard side there. What happens to the ones that are too small in this game? So the, the, the female and the small ones get thrown back in the water. 
Uh, so the ones that are red on the table, I'll show you when we go back down, but the ones that are red on the table are the ones you can't keep, you can't sell them, which is the same way in real life. The small ones, the juveniles and the, and the female crab get thrown back in the water. So, uh, But they just get thrown back. That way they can they continue to, to produce or grow or whatever else needs to happen. We went way past that movie. I have to actually back up. Actually, we didn't. We nailed it. Okay. I've yet to actually watch that thing come up. I don't know if it just appeared now or if it was actually rolling it up or not because you can't really hear any of that. So. Yeah, I think some of my major issues is it just, even even with the rain and stuff, you know, the addition, it still sounds hollow too. Like there's not a whole lot of stuff going on on deck and maybe the weather's just too loud. Maybe that's what it is. Did I restart? Yes, I did. Uh, mainly because we weren't on the Northwestern boat. I didn't have a save with the Northwestern boat, so... Or the White Star, or whatever it's called. Man, this boat's really getting tossed around right now. Hard to stay on this northeast heading. really crazy weather really crazy weather to the next one yeah i just don't feel like we're in any kind of danger of of losing the boat or you know what i mean like i don't feel like there's anything dangerous here which is a bad feeling when you're playing the deadliest catch right you should feel some sort of danger in some way it's my opinion of course but that's the way it feels anyway Camera's still doing some funky things too, but. Still nabbed it. Oh man. Have you tried intentionally capsizing the boat? Yeah, well, I mean, I, I can't find any way to actually do it. You can turn as hard as you want, as fast as you want, in waves as big as you want. And it just, it's like it's on flat water. Like it's floating around on glass. As far as I can see, there's no way to actually intentionally capsize anything. As far as I can tell, anyway. I may be wrong, but... get started that next one here and then we'll uh grab some of this good crab off the table nope wrong button that one
Close that back so nobody kills an ankle on it. There's the next buoy in sight. Yeah, you can break the boat now. There's actually, I mean, towing actually makes a difference, but I haven't been able to do it. <laughs> I haven't been able to do it at all. So I actually hit this throw here. Pretty good ways out there. Yeah, we missed completely. Yep, have a good one, ACDC. Appreciate you hanging out with us. I'm glad you got to catch one myself. Thank you for being here. Man, I still missed. Okay, try it again. It's a long reel. I did not mean to throw that. <laughs> I just moved my mouse. Alright, let's see if we can hit it this time. I think I'm too far away. closer all right maybe that'll help get a little closer but still not uh At least I can see the yellow buoy now. See, the red one's easy. It's the other one that I have trouble seeing. I can kind of see it. I wish there was a way to take the, uh, the helper guy off the bottom there because it's really hindering my shot here. I think that got it right there. Yeah, there we go, finally. Yeah, that's a good throw right there. That's a, that's a pretty good distance away. Commercial fishing boat, yeah. I mean, it'd be kind of be kind of nice to have a boat. I ain't been out on a boat in a long time. I mean, it's been a while. All right, back up to the uh, captain's captain's uh, quarters, captain's. Captain's chair, I guess. I don't. Was that my last one? Really not. Hang on now. What bait do I have in here? Six. That was my last one. That can't be right. We'll drop forward a little bit just to see if I dropped one way out here somewhere. build your own though I mean that's kind of smart actually that's very smart actually I think that's it okay cool Turn around jog back the other direction then.
Yeah, they show up a little red icon on your mini map, so I guess that's all of them. Get turned around. Turn it around, turn it around. Hit my pedals, my feet. Hit my pedals and my feet. Oh man, these big waves. I'm glad we're gonna get to skip time here in a minute. Doesn't necessarily mean we're gonna get out of the weather, but we're gonna get to skip time anyway. Yeesh. It's just hard to see the buoys at night in these really big waves like this. Yikes, that's crazy. So it definitely feels different in the cab than it does out on the deck. Out on the deck, it's hard to even tell you're rolling around as much. In here, it's, it's perfectly visible because you've got a bunch of straight lines you can adhere to. <laughs> so you know, you know exactly how much it's bouncing. So you mentioned a minute ago that it looks different from the update you have. Uh, from the update to Red Brick Game, it looks different from the restart I did uh, the other day. The crab was all different colors. So I put it on an old save uh, and then it started a new game, so I don't know, man. I really have no idea what the, what the dealio is, you know? Like, I should have... Um, they, they added different color to the game, right? So they added blue crab, they added some more stuff, correct? Or was that in, uh, was that in Barrett C? That they added blue crab and, um, Opie's, Opelio crab? Or was that this? I really don't remember. I'm, I'm pretty lost on that part. Yeah, I'm pretty lost there. What is this, two days in a row we spent just floating around the ocean? I should have thought this decision through a little better. <laughs> two days in a row of just floating around in the ocean. storm at sea can last from 12 to 200 hours yeah it's crazy isn't it a lot of these guys fishing go through some severe stuff for quite a long time i think it's pretty awesome um they do it to make money of course but i mean we also get uh also get crab meat out of it so that's good one of my favorite thing in the world is crab legs you know those little crab cakes you can get from captain d's yeah frozen crab crab things <laughs> I say frozen because we know they come frozen. We're not stupid. We're not dumb. It's taking a long time to jog back over here, isn't it? All right, we got a lot less done today than I thought it was going to be. I'm already an hour and a half in. Uh, and I didn't even realize how long I'd actually been sitting here playing. This is pretty wild, honestly. I'm definitely tired, I can tell. <laughs> I can definitely tell. It doesn't seem like it's been an hour and a half. At all. Oh my god, the wave waves just crashed over the over the the uh What is this called? What where the captain is? What is it called? Uh the wheelhouse. Yeah, the waves just crashed over the wheelhouse. That was pretty nuts. You've eaten crab and priced it, uh, and they priced it out at market value. Hmm. 
Yeah, there's, there's a reason it's called, uh, that, that is in my wheelhouse, right? There's a reason that's a saying. It's because of the wheelhouse. $68 a plate. That is insane. I mean, a lot of the, a lot of the crab legs I get are at, like, buffet-style crab legs. Uh, the casino is the only place that I've ever paid more than $20 for a buffet with crab legs. They like those there. They are happy to charge you whatever people are willing to pay. I think one night it was like $55 or $60 or something. It's crazy. Hey, man, I came here to win money. <laughs> I'll spend it all on crab legs. The upper deck house? Yes. <laughs> exactly. I came here to win money, not spend it on crab legs. Dang, y'all. Going to do dad stuff. See everyone later. All right, Joe. Have a good one, man. Appreciate you. Uh, I'm probably not going to go much longer. So you can catch the last few minutes on playback if you want, if you want to later. Am I going to be on Twist night? I hope so, yeah. Yeah, when I get done here, I'm going to run to the post office stuff, try to take a quick nap, and then be doing some snow runner over there tonight, probably. Since I am dead tired, the snow runner normally keeps me awake uh, for the most part because it's... There's, there's always something moving, right? Always. So, I do I do pretty good at night when I'm playing SnowRunner. Or Trials or Rocket League or anything else that, that's constantly got my attention. Ten people in total, you spent $600 on dinner without the tip. My goodness. My goodness. Can you name your, name your own vessel? You can, yeah. You absolutely can. Uh, I don't know if you can... The name is actually right there, I think, or it was. I don't know why you can't see it now, but yeah, it's called the Outhouse. Yeah, you can name your own vessel for sure. And there's two boats to choose from now, which is kind of neat. What's up, Ralph? How's it going? Your boat seems to be moving. It, it is slowly, yeah. Uh, so some of these waves we're hitting is actually pushing us backwards. And some of them we're going, we, we usually ride about 12 knots, but sometimes we get up to 13, 14, and then we go down to about 10 and back and forth, you know? Uh, these waves are so big out here in the Bering Sea that we actually slow down going uphill, which having that fifth and sixth uh, gear is nice. You can go a little faster. See you, Joe. Have a good one, bud. Don't forget to save. That is an excellent point. I've done that before. I played for like two or three hours on here and then forgot to save and lost all the progress. I think it was when their auto save thing was messed up. And I don't know if there is an auto save anymore, to be fair. I'm probably going to stack them this time around. And, uh, maybe all of it. Man, with these big waves, this is taking forever. Holy crap, what happened there? I think we just glitched under the water. Or it felt like it anyway. That was kind of odd for a second. Uh, but yeah, I'm probably going to stack them this time around. And hopefully we get some calm weather to stack in. Um, I've got 19, uh, no, I've got 4,800 pounds of 16,000 pounds on the boat. So... We are right about 25% capacity, I guess. You tip the server 400 bucks. Well, I mean, that makes sense. That's a pretty big bill. That's still a pretty big tip, but it's a pretty big bill, so. You name the boat the outhouse? That's actually kind of smart. You'll never sink. I'll let you figure out why. Well, that's because turds float, man. <laughs> we know. We know the business. All right, let's get turned around here. We got a buoy back behind me, which is good. Try to make a little distance out to the side here first. Slow down to neutral and just do a spin. Ride the wave. I was looking at that next one up there. That's the one I should be looking at. Yeah, I'm going to put my guy on a stack this time. We'll see what the... Uh, wrong button. This one. Uh, let's see. Place pot on the launcher. That's pot setting. Pot collecting. 
Uh, place pot on launcher. We don't want him to do that. We want him to store pot. There we go. And I don't know if I'm going to switch back and forth between these or not, but I probably will. I probably will. Oh my goodness. This is going to be kind of tough. Uh, hopefully we get some good weather. Let's go ahead and skip time right here. And just hope we get some good weather here. Alright, we're going to rest for another 18 hours. Still not good weather. That's not good. Uh, looks like the sun is starting to come out a little bit, though. Maybe it's going to clear up soon. There's a buoy out here somewhere. We got pushed way back. Way back. I was right up next to this thing, I think. Oh my goodness. That wave just turned our boat. Oh, I know I'm in reverse. Okay, that makes sense. Never mind. <laughs> I thought I was in neutral. Was that wave just turned our boat completely the opposite direction I wanted to go? Where's this buoy? Oh, there it is. So where's this thing at? All right, let's go try to catch this thing. Oh man, I can't even see it. There we go. That was wild. Like it disappeared for a minute. Well, how's this going, crab over here? Oh crap, we gotta we gotta put the crab up. Give me my, give me this. I will right, we'll let that pot hang there for a minute. Get rid of all this crab here now. I don't want to use, I want to throw crab out. Alright, hang on, hang on. Does not, oh my god, water coming over the, water coming over the, uh, the side there. This is, alright, this is getting kind of weird. Uh, I don't feel like it's safe to be out here anymore, but we got to get this done. More water over over the side. Open that. Get them in there. Let's get them in there so we can get this get these pots out of the water. Big thunder. Big thunder. Alright, I'm gonna drop this over here now. And we will let the hook back down. Looks like some more good crab. Uh, let's put, let's see, let me go back to this. I don't think we need him on pot setting. Let's go to pot collecting here. Oh, wait a minute. If I do that, throwing out crabs, place a pot on launcher, throwing out crabs. Okay, and then storing pot. There we go. It gives me an opportunity to pick up buoys and whatnot and do little things. Little things. I'm going to turn my flashlight on so we can get a little visual here on what's happening. I'm pretty sure there's lights on this boat somewhere. Backwards, forward, throw out. Uh, turn to cooler. Aha! Uh -huh. I've been doing this in the dark the whole time. Two hours I've been doing this in the dark. Alright, how many crab we end up with? 80. Uh, yeah, 80 crab. That's not bad. Been doing this in the dark the whole dang time. Why didn't y'all tell me? Nobody said, hey, turn your lights on, dummy. What's up, Mike? How's it going, buddy? Mike, I think Cletus is still broke on YouTube. I appreciate it though. Do hit the like button if you are enjoying or if you just enjoy the game or if you just enjoy relaxing. That's that's the main thing. I appreciate you being here to hang out and support. Uh, hitting the like button is another way to do that. Oh man, we just ran that one over, I think. It's right here next to me somewhere. I just gotta get off of it. 
There we go. We got close to that one. Sixty on deck. Thirty eight. Seventy eight more crab. I'll take it. I'll take it. That's a good day. Like he's stacking pots again back there. Two of eight on deck. Oh man, big rollers, big rollers. They were cruising in the trough too, man. Sometimes it feels like, I don't think these waves have any kind of like direction though. If you look at them, they're just all kind of going different directions. There's no like actual trough or, or anything. Like this one over here. Look at this. It's coming from this way. And then we got one coming from behind us. There's one coming from that way over there. They all look like they're going the same direction, but when you actually look at it, there's no actual real like roller or trough. Uh, it's just kind of sporadic. See? See? That one's going away from us now. The other one just hit us coming head on, so. I'm still vaping, I am, yeah. Yep, sadly. Flavors we're using, so I've got one that's um, let's see, uh, custard, not too sweet, creamy with the right hints of fruit. I've got one that is a creamy, milky strawberry cereal, which is probably my favorite, and then a uh, milk after a bowl of fruity, sugary cereal. So uh, I like my fruity, fruity flavored with custards, uh, but I also like the custard. Custards are good. Sometimes something just to tone it down a bit helps. So. You're still vaping. I'm still disappointed. I know, man. I know. But I had not had a cigarette a year, so I guess that's something. <laughs> I was vaping and smoking, so... Uh, getting rid of the cigarettes for the last year has been a challenge. Uh, even while I'm vaping. To say the least, it's been a challenge. Blueberry mango sounds interesting. I don't think I've ever actually had blueberry in anything. Most of, most of the time it's like, uh, creamy, milky, you know, some sort of cream or custard base is what I, what I like. And I don't like a whole lot of fruitiness, it's more the custard base that I like. Oh, I bet it sounds good. It sounds good. Yeah, I've never had anything with blueberry in it. Sounds like something I should look into when we buy again. I mean, the hard part is now it's hard to buy it online, so it's like, you know. One of them things, I reckon. Yeah, my problem is I just don't have a whole lot of willpower, so <laughs> quitting is, is going to be harder than I thought it would be, I think. I can't believe I missed that. Well, at least I can see both movies now. That's good. 
A minute ago it looked like they were lined up straight on. I threw way off to the side too, look at that. Right there. Nailed it. Why does it pull in so much faster when you got the when you got the pot attached? Seems like it'd be the other way around, doesn't it? I think I forgot to drop the buoys for the other one, didn't I? Or did I? No, that was that one. We're good. And waves still coming over the side. Yeah, it's definitely getting... I think it's getting lighter out. What time is it? 9.35 a.m. and it's still dark out. My goodness. The crab we got on the table. Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. We may actually be able to go in with this load. Uh, with short seasons like this, I don't like to go in, but I would like to go see how much money we make. And, uh, maybe buy some upgrades before we get done today. mango trying it kind of takes over the blueberry that's understandable they're both really strong flavors though so uh it, it seems it seems like one would take over the other if it's not balanced properly you know what i mean no matter which way it would be seems like you would always have that issue Four more pots to go. May try to hit these on the move. See how good I am. A little bit closer here. Well, that was odd. The one buoy was like completely out of the water. Oh god, I'm in his way. Gotta get back up to the wheelhouse, we gotta find this next buoy. I was pretty sure I got an off course pretty bad, I did. I did it though, we caught it, running, running 12 knots. And that never happens. <laughs> never. Which means I should be able to catch this next one if we do it right. Oh, there it goes. Five on the deck. Five on the deck. All right, let's go. Should be right in line here. Coming up quick. Let's get ready. Oh man, of course I hit a big wave. Oh no. Oh no, we just we just flew past it. I gotta reel the rope in quick. Run! Run! Why are the buoys so tangled up like that, man? The whole idea is they're supposed to be split up, right? Thought I had it too, man. So close. I mean, we flew right past it. <laughs> right on by. Oh my goodness, from this angle, you can really tell we're getting thrown around. Definitely getting thrown around. Well, now they're straightened out, of course. Yeah, look at that. They do all kinds of weird stuff when the when the wave hits them. It's so strange. It's so strange. The buoys stretch out and get all funny looking. Weird. Super weird. How are we doing over here on the deck? I'm in on the table. All right, we're not close to 500 yet. We're okay. All right, next one up. Let's uh, see if we can get back on track here. We are way off. We're way off target.
There's a problem right there, dude. Boats don't fly. That's true. That's true. <laughs> But you're trying to quit smoking cigarettes, it does help. It does, it does. Um, so I started, when I started vaping, I started on six, Nick. Uh, and I've been using three for the past year and a half. And I mean, there are days I use a little more juice than others, but I mean, for the most part, three, Nick, does it for me. I know a lot of people that buy 20, Nick, and I'm going, you're not really doing yourself any favors because you're not cutting down your nicotine level. Of course, I'm not really doing myself any favors by continuing on after I cut down to three, Nick, so. I'm not really one to talk. <laughs> but I mean, you get the idea, though. I just I don't understand going from cigarettes to 20 nick. It's it's really worse for you, nicotine level wise. All right, here we go. We got this one. We got this one. We can do this. Oh my God! Look at the waves. They're just killing me right now. Got it. What a throw. What a like a pro. God, the waves are just everywhere. I want to see this deck full of uh, full of pots. And there is a way on here you can buy a perk to get more, I think. All right, how you doing back there, buddy? Uh, hello? Oh, he's got a hundred on the table. Okay. Well, crap. Let's get lined up with this one and then we'll just slow down. If I can find it. Oh my God. It was coming up quick. go let me get some of the crab off the table for him I'll let the hook up first there we go get some off this side wait do I have two pots left look I do where's the other one? Oh, it's in the water that's right it's in the water all right there we go Take those. All right, we should be able to dump that pot now, bud. You know what? I got it, buddy. I got it. Don't don't move. It's fine. Uh, there you go. Now you're now you're getting the idea. Not gonna push the button. I got it. I got it, fella. I know you're you're working hard over there. You're confused okay I understand completely we'll go ahead and get this one in the block there we go now he's getting it yeah like he broke for a minute he's good now though all right, let's go check the, the crab pots here. 78% on pretty much all of them, it looks like. So yeah, a couple of trips through, and you're going to have to do some repair jobs on your uh, um, your pots. All right, cool. Uh, and he's got a good bit of sorting to do, so we're going to uh, probably just use fast travel. And he should have them sorted by the time we get back to... Uh, Back to Dutch. Hopefully. I hope he does anyway. Oh, you know what? I'm going to have to go back out a little bit, though. I just thought about this. I'm going to have to go back out uh, to just right here, I guess. And put the crab in the tank. <laughs> Can't sell it if it ain't in the tank. It's all sorted, though. Go get our, uh, our toad here. There we go. Let's drop all this off. Nope, let's get the hook out of the way again. Tater salad. 
coming in with a hundred Danish kroner. Thank you, man, for the hundred Danish kroner. Much appreciated. Get some hearts in chat. Show some love. Hundred Danish kroner. Keep the lights on. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. It is doing that. It is doing that. Thank you, man. Much appreciated. Uh, there should be a pop-up for it. There it is. Not going to have any sound. This is my Twitch thing. I've got to get one made for, for YouTube. It's a generic and not a... Uh, Medieval's Dynasty or Lumberjack's Dynasty overlay. But it popped up anyway. I thank you, man. Thank you kindly. Alright, let's, let's store this last pot ourselves since he's not going to. Uh, use the crane. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Uh, can't see because he's there. Get out of that one. Let's go to this one. go over here Boop. okay looks like it fell right into place sweet all right we got all our crab put up let's head into dutch i don't know why i'm going back here i'm just gonna fast travel in anyway <laughs> let's go fast travel anyway hey it's daylight look at there all right processing plan we got ten thousand pounds of crab which is pretty nice because normally I come in real short hundred and sixteen thousand dollars that is real nice actually uh, which means we're gonna get more people to upgrade but that is gonna do it for me today uh, kind of kind of short it's two hours which is about normal but I've been trying to go a little longer than that uh, I do have some errands and such I have to run so uh, I will uh, be back on twitch later tonight if you guys want to find me over there twitch.tv slash do some mess you're more than welcome to come hang out for some snow runner and some stream raiders gonna come hang out there uh probably somewhere in the neighborhood of around around 9 15 p.m central time so 10 15, 10, 15 eastern uh if you guys want to come hang out for that i appreciate it appreciate you guys being here thank you for the super chat and uh appreciate everybody hitting the like button on your way out and if you're new and you're watching this later subscribe come back watch some different games with us as well uh, i'll see you guys later tonight have a good one later everybody